Hi, um, this is a, a rock recliner that I purchased from Walmart last week. Uh, they delivered it for free. Um, it only cost me $189 delivered, which I was uh, very impressed with. I used to work in a furniture store and uh, when I was a kid, and uh, I still remember the huge markup um, on furniture. They charge uh, their customers uh, even the furniture on sale. So that's why I decided to try the much cheaper uh, option from Walmart. Um, this matches uh, actually uh, um, the quality uh, that you'll get in a much higher priced rocker recliner. Uh, it's uh, upholstered in microfiber. Uh, I think it only comes in this one color. Um, as you can see, it's the beige color, uh, attractive. Um, it's very easy to assemble. Uh, it comes in a box that's uh, easily manageable. Uh, the assembly involves uh, just sliding the back portion here uh, along some rails uh, <clears throat> on the back. It took about probably 10 seconds for me to do that. There's no tools involved. Uh, you just push down and it locks in place and that's it. Um, uh, again, it's very comfortable, uh, very uh, very nice chair to watch television in. It reclines all the way back. It's not a wall hugger, uh, but it's um, but it's small, it's compact. Uh, I'm about 5'9", 140 pounds, and it fits me perfectly. Um, actually, I'm a bigger person. Uh, it might not be the best fit. Uh, you might have to uh, give it a test sit, you know, before you actually purchase it. But if you're about maybe 150, 160 pounds, uh, up to about 6'1", I think, uh, it would probably fit uh, you very well. Um, the only problem uh, that I've had with it, it's a small problem for me, is uh, the button. Uh, on the side uh, that reclines, uh, it's, you can see there's a button on the side, and you just like pull it out, and it pushes back fine very easily, but it's a little bit difficult to um, actually close once it's opened. Um, you have to give it a good back kick uh, to close it all the way, which uh, takes some getting used to. If you have uh, weak legs, uh, it might be. Uh, a little bit of a problem or back problems too might cause you some discomfort uh, when you have to close the recliner and uh, I can show you uh, <coughs> what I have to do to, uh, to close it uh, there's a little technique uh, that's a little bit easier let me just pull around here and <coughs> open it up as you can see it's uh, and I just have a recline now uh, to close it the best way to do it is to uh, uh, push it down just a little bit and just give it a swift back kick and it closes fine uh, And it shouldn't be a problem for most people, but for some people it might be a problem But other than that, uh, that's the only problem. Uh, I'm very impressed with this recliner. It's very comfortable um, I did use some uh, I bought a can of scotch guard uh, just in case uh, to protect it a little bit more which uh, I think at Walmart, uh, <clears throat> you can get a can of that for about six dollars. But uh, uh, again, you can't beat the price. It's uh, you save a lot of money for a quality rocker recliner. So uh, you might want to consider this chair if you're in a market for one. Okay, have a good day.